Hi folks, Kevin here from Rolling Love Shack Adventures and tonight we're going to give you a tour of our hiker setup while we're camped here at Forbes State Forest in Farmington, Pennsylvania. Alright, this is our hiker setup. We've got a 12 by 12 anti-pool awning from Easy Fast. We picked this up on Amazon. Uh, as you can see, it fits well over the door of the trailer and a little bit over the back edge we can still get in the galley. Got our dragonfly lights, which are solar, they light up at night. And we have the 5x8 mid range hiker with a single door on the passenger side of the vehicle. Rear cabinets in the back, we chose to have it closed off so we don't have a pass through to the galley. Uh, we installed the 12 volt USB plug so we can charge phones and have 12 volt for our my CPAP machine and then we also installed a couple cup holders have the standard cubbies in the front also installed another plug in the front we have the max fan and ring light and then we put in the farmer shelf ourselves We traded in our Coleman and upgraded to the Everest camp stove for cooking. And then here's our galley. We chose the closed off galley. And here we bring our stuff in totes for the pantry then set up when we get to camp. For power we use the Jackery 500 which is wired into the galley and into the rest of the trailer. We did the 12 volt prep so we wouldn't have to do the extra work and we just ran a few wires through the walls. Thanks to Matt's suggestion we've installed the strip lights in the galley for nighttime. for our stove instead of using the 12 volt canisters we have a propane hose hooked to our 20 pound tank and while we camp we like to do a little dutch oven cooking which we have set up here on our aluminum stand a couple animal feed trays to hold the coals we went with a large tongue box where we keep our chalks pie irons hot dog sticks bungee cords, tools, and extra supplies. We originally planned to put our batteries in here, but I think the Jackery is going to work for our electrical needs, and I don't think we're going to give up the extra space by putting the battery in the tongue box. And then when we're boondocking, this is our shower bathroom setup. Just a collapsible toilet seat from Amazon with a bucket underneath and some cat litter and then a five gallon bucket we fill with our hot water and have a rechargeable pump shower head system we use for our shower. Perfect enough for two people for hot showers on the road.